One day after the ceasefire in the Gaza Strip, Premier Ismail Khania packs his suitcase and heads for an official tour on his armored Mercedes. He's headed for Egypt despite the fact that nobody is expecting him there, but Khania is pleased with himself after achieving a ceasefire. The tour will be followed by a trip to Damascus and Tehran, and Khania hopes to bring home some money in order to resolve the economic crisis. And here's the side of Mahmoud Abbas regarding the ceasefire. He also wants to reap political advantages, and while Khania is in Damascus, he will meet American Secretary of State Condoleezza Rice in Jericho next Thursday. Abbas wants to begin speaking to Israel, and so he applauds the speech of Premier Olmert. And here's tomorrow's vedette, King Abdallah, who will host President Bush in Amman. When King Abdallah hears about optimism, he wants a piece of it. لهذه القضية ولا بأي تسوية تكون على حساب الأردن Meetings scheduled for the coming days don't level up to the Aqaba summit's long-term political objectives but are rather a parenthesis after the ceasefire.